Hi, welcome back to Impossible 2.0. Next up, I have Sagittarius. Where are my possible Sagittarius at? The time now is 8.20. Okay, I'm sorry I started late. <clears throat> it's just one of those weeks for me. I haven't been getting rest. I can't believe I'm working on three hours of sleep. Six hours in total for two days. <laughs> so I haven't been sleeping well, okay? Some of you guys are working rest like tirelessly. Some of you guys live in Texas as well. I picked that up. Texas or moving to Texas, planning to move to Texas or something like that. Okay? Um, ten. Okay, so yeah. Two is all about metamorphosis. Eight is a finished business manifestation. Um, eight also means abundance. So you're manifesting. Ten is closing out a cycle. So you're entering into a new phase. So let's see what's going on in your energy because I'm feeling real drained. I'm trying. I was trying to get into your energy, but some of you guys are working tirelessly, not getting enough sleep, shit like that. So overthinking. So let's see what's going on, Sagittarius. Yes, chaos. But it, okay, chaos in reverse. Some of you guys may be having problems with your kids or trying to resolve a problem with a child here. Um, some of you guys are trying to resolve a situation in a situation period, whether it's at work, whether it's in your home life, but it's chaos around you, but you're trying to resolve a situation here. You're trying to make peace. Okay, leadership. Yes, I do see a promotion and signing contracts. Yes, so you may be getting some type of promotion coming your way. All right, yes, but taking the lead in your life. Taking the lead in your life, embodying... Um, Empress status as well. Some of you guys are filling out application, resumes, apartments, okay? But I do see business deals, okay? Read over the fine print, but I do see a promotion of some sort. Yes. But really head over heart at this time. Delegating tasks. Some of you guys may be going to court as well, negotiating deals or taking out paperwork. Some of you guys may be um, getting married as well, okay? Yes. But let's see what's going on here, Sag. Yes. Oh, there you go. The hidden enemy. I felt it too. Yes. Third party situation. Children involved here for some of you guys. Yes. Some of you guys are married and you find out about a third party situation and possibly children. Some of you guys may have two or more children, twins or boys. Okay. Yeah. You feel alienated. You feel like you don't belong. Some of you guys may be dealing with a different culture or traveling to a different place. Yes. These are karmic cycles. These are karmic lessons that you're learning. That you need that you need to apply to your life, but there is deception around you here, okay? And again, some of you guys are getting married, some of you guys are getting out of a marriage, marriage. Some of you guys are dealing with somebody that's married. Children being be a factor here, like you know, um, mm. blocking a union here. <sighs> some of you guys may be having, uh, maybe trying to have children as well, okay? Yes, yeah, some of you guys are trying to get out of a marriage, okay, or negotiating some deal like who the children should be with and stuff like that. All right, so let's see here. But this could be family. This could be friends. But hidden enemy. Yes, abundance. Okay, wow. Your money is definitely fucking coming in. Sagittarius, there's no doubt about that. You're getting... To... Give me my money. Okay, yes. You're all about the Benjamins, baby. Uh-huh, single life. Yeah, so some of you guys are getting out of a marriage. Some of you guys are single getting married. Or, you know, some of you guys are getting out of a marriage contract okay but if you guys are single i see that somebody's going to be coming in and um it's going to lead to marriage okay this may be somebody that live at a distance have children a divorcee or different culture okay yes so you're trying to find purpose Yes, online, yeah, online dating, this person may live a distance. Some of you guys may have an online presence, opening up your own social media. Something may have been found out online as well. Be careful with um, <clears throat> arguments, cyberbullying, okay? Yes, I do see um, snooping, researching, taking place, snooping through email and trying to search for something here. Some of you guys may do a lot of online shopping as well or opening up your own online business, whatever that may be. Um, but I do see somebody searching through your text messages, through your phone log, yes, emails, something like that. Somebody may have changed their password as well, okay? But I do see you getting back on the dating scene. That's for some of you guys, but you're not settling for, the, for a bad match either. <clears throat> yes, birth. There you go. Somebody, some of you guys are pregnant as well, pregnant with a boy or pregnant with twins. But this is starting over. You're going through a rebirth. You may be finding out somebody's pregnant as well. Some of you guys may be um, looking for a surrogate or infertility clinics, something like that. 
Yeah, waiting game. Okay, yeah, some of you guys are waiting. It's like your biological clock is ticking. Okay, so some of you guys are ready to have a baby. That's for some of you guys. Okay, yes, but you're waiting for something. You're waiting for something, waiting for, because manifestation is taking place, possibly a new job, possibly um, having a baby, okay, getting married, something here, okay, waiting for the answers, waiting for someone, that's for some of you guys, but Spirit is saying, don't put your life on hold for waiting for anyone, okay, yes. Oh, trial and error, that flew out, some of you guys may be um, forensic science, chemist out there, um, love um, astrology, experimenting. Okay, experimenting. Yes. Some of you guys are preparing, are, are training to learn a new job as well, leadership role. But you're exploring all possibilities of life, right? Trying new things. Willing to try new things and learn new things. Yes, love. It came out fumbled. Ooh. Okay, when it comes to the love department... <laughs> Some of you guys are, it's a love-hate relationship with people or in your marriage or with uh, somebody that you're with or with your kids. It's a love-hate relationship right now. Your love is, some of you guys are falling out of love with someone. This is more of, I care for you, but I'm not in love with you anymore. I care for your welfare, but I'm not in love. So some of you guys are, yeah, mm -hmm. okay, you care for the person, but you're not totally there anymore, okay? <clears throat> Yes, but there's going to be a turnaround in your love department as well. But this is a love-hate kind of thing going on here. Yes, travel. Yeah, travel may be delayed, but I did see traveling as well. Okay, some of you guys may work for the airlines, planning a trip, but it may be delayed. Okay? Mm -hmm. And again, you may be meeting somebody at a distance. Or, yes, our, yeah, the wheel. Wheel of Fortune. Destiny is at play here. Good luck, karma. Um, it's a turnaround in your circumstances. You may be dealing with an Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio. But big changes are coming, okay? Things working in your favor. So let's see. Some of you guys are uncertain whether you want to have children or not, okay? There may be a, a toss-up, a debate whether you want to have children or not. If you guys are married and you haven't, you don't have kids yet. It's like a toss-up. Some, you you may feel like it and then you may not feel like it. Like you know what? No, I, we're just good. Yeah, check your health. Okay, some of you guys are exercising again. <clears throat> some of you guys may be going to school for healthcare as well, going into some type of surgery. But um, you know, maintain a, a healthy diet, but get a routine checks up checkup at the doctor. A turnaround in your health as well. Yes, ghosting in reverse. Somebody who ghosted you is coming back around. So that's what some of you guys. Some of you guys may belong to the LGBTQ community as well. Yes, there's unfinished business here with you and someone. Somebody wants to clear the air here. Okay, but yeah, somebody wants to see things through. But it's you're trying to solve a mystery here. Yeah, somebody from your past is returning. There may have been obstacles in the way of you and this person um, as well. This could be a friend. This could be family. This could be a lover. But somebody may have been married here. And it was causing blockages, children, you know, it, it's causing blockages, okay, teamwork. Yes, I see that you're building the new team, but I also feel that you're burned out. You, some of you guys may have a new position where you're delegating tasks and working all type of odd hours, have a lot of work on you, yes. And it's like, oh, exhausted, that's how I always feel, like, exhausted, burn the fuck out. Yeah, some of you guys are bored and up for change, but I do see a date coming. Some of you guys need to declutter as well. Okay, some of you guys are into housekeeping or opening up your own online um, cleaning service or uh, working the laundromat or um, clean for a living, something like that. Okay, some of you guys may be school bus drivers, teachers, educators um, as well, work with children in particular, um, you know, special, special needs uh, children. Okay, but again... It's something that you're, it's not adding up to you that you're trying to figure out here. But I do see somebody dating. Yeah, poor health. You're overthinking something here. Some of you guys may need to check, um, may need to um, see a mental health um, physician or um, check your head. Something about your head, but you're not sleeping real, well. Uh, you're not sleeping well, suffering from headaches. Um, yes, something like that. Neglecting your, your, your health. Okay. One more. Yes, there's a snake. Boom. I can't make this up. There's a snake around you, and th there's delays here. Okay? Yes. But spirit wants you to, yeah, evil eye being sent your way. 
Um, Spirit wants you to set those healthy boundaries, though. You may be dealing with an Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio. You're going through a powerful renewal process. Yes, there may be a lot of chemistry between you and a person, but I do see chemistry go coming in. Be careful with temptation. Some of you guys may wear, love to wear red lipstick, but fire. This is you. Fire. It's all about action. So everything is happening in divine timing, okay? Yes, your manifestation is coming in divine timing, but again, protect your energy. Yeah, finances. Your finances may be off. Okay, trying to clear up debt, student loans, uh, pay bills, uh, credit cards, car notes. Yes, but your finances is, is something off with your finances, and you're trying to you're trying to generate more money, manifest more money. But there's evil eye, and I do see sad news. But happiness, okay, happiness. So yes, your angels are protecting you at this time and guiding you. They, you're you're being divinely guided. Uh huh. Some of you guys' name may be angel as well. Okay, so let's see what's going on here. But there's definitely blockages here. And I want to get down to the bottom of what this is because somebody's trying to cause chaos, but you're you're moving away from chaos. You're moving away from it. But there may be chaos still going on. Okay. Yes, extra trigger. That's how you're feeling. A lot of fire. You feel an extra trigger. Yeah, you have an impersonator here that's jealous right on top of you, trying to copy your style, trying to bite your style. We're going to figure out who this is. Kiss your ass. This could be a sibling. This could be a friend. This could be at work. Yes, moving. There's delays in moving, but I do see you guys moving. Okay, there's somebody creeping, watching, watching over you. There, be careful with drama starters as well. Some of you guys are packing. Yeah, somebody's running away from the truth here. Okay, trying to avoid something here, but this was a runner and chaser dynamic. You're not running anymore. You're not running. You stop the chase. Okay. Yes, queen. You're all about bossing up, leveling up here. Some of you guys may be dealing with a Virgo or have Scorpio moon. Yes, fake smiles. There we go. <sighs> oh, somebody's getting some type of photo proof as well. Some of you guys may be photographers, take a lot of pictures. Yes, it's a waiting game. Something that you're waiting for, but Spirit is saying, wait, uh, have patience. Okay, yes. Mm. Somebody's crying. Okay, crying and depressed. Okay, you may be dealing with a broke ass or some of you guys are struggling financially. Okay, somebody may be in a romantic love affair, a fuck buddy here, a sex fix, secret, secret lovers. <laughs> yes, low vibrational, in reverse. Okay, so try it. Spirit is saying, raise your vibration, but you may have been dealing with somebody that was low vibrational. Some of you guys are having family issues with children as well. Yes, you're blocking people. Okay. Yes, you're moving on. Thank you, next. But there's a struggle here. You guys are overthinking something, head in the clouds, or somebody's thinking about you. Yes, bad karma. But somebody's going through their karma, either you or somebody else. I'm going to figure it out. But, yeah, but there's a drama starter. Here we go. Keep showing itself. You have a lot of clouds around you, Sagittarius. And cyberbullying. What I said. What I said. Be careful with this. Okay, same shit, different day. But some of you guys are acting like everything is okay. It's the same shit, different day. But there's definitely something going on in your energy. Okay, you're off. You're, you're trying to maintain positive. Not to get there. Yeah, stuck in the past. There you go. Some of you guys are still healing from the past, childhood trauma. Okay, but there was something significant that happened in the past that you're still reflecting on, that you still need to heal. Okay, yes, but stuck in the past. Something, something, again, you need to release it. Karmic cycles. Yes, there's a lot of confusion. This is how I'm feeling, confused. Okay, yes, a lot of evil eye being sent your way, and there's blockages. There is a new job coming as well, but there's a missing piece to the puzzle that you're trying to figure out here. You un you don't understand what's going on with you, why you feel so confused, why there's blockages, you know, because I see moving, but again, 
is like stuck. It's it, you want to move, but it's a stuck energy. Yes, there's skeletons in the closet. Here we go. The grass is fake. Okay, so it's time to mow the lawn. This is all about your spiritual growth and transformation. Okay, pay attention to the angel numbers. You may be dealing with somebody that's stubborn as well. Yes, astral traveling. Pay attention to your dreams. What is this? Oh, okay, dead. You may be finding out somebody passed away as well. Okay. Somebody that passed over may be trying to connect with you through your dream state, like your ancestors or somebody close to you is trying to connect with you through your dream. Okay. Yes, Scorpio. But you're going through a transformation. You're all about leveling up. Okay. But you definitely have a copycat here. Yes. Some of you guys are struggling. Praying for an answer. You know, staying prayed up. But some of you guys are homeless. But, you know, or dealing with a codependent relationship. But struggling. Struggling. Okay. Yes, yeah, meant to be. There's somebody else coming in that's meant to be. Possibly some somebody that works in the entertainment industry. Um, music, uh, a band, um, teach music, writers. Some, some type of performer coming in. Yes, but there's a fork in the road. Mm. Decisions. Some of you guys are performers as well. Termination, you're fired. Something is ending here. A codependent relationship. Be careful with drugs, okay? Because I do see something affecting your health in terms of drugs. So be careful with who you use drugs with or who you buy drugs with, um, drugs from. Okay, somebody may have OD'd here as well. Okay, passed away here. But some of you guys are, are addicted to some type of painkillers or, or sedatives here. Yes, catfish. Somebody's definitely spying on you and getting tire readings. You may be getting tire readings on someone, else, someone as well. Okay, but judgment. This may be a Sagittarius or a Scorpio. Yes, cleanse your space. Definitely. You may be dealing with somebody younger or immature. You may have kids with this person. There's a celebration coming though. Okay, but you will feel like you're at a breaking point. That's how I feel. In and out, in and out, in and out. This is an in and out kind of uh, reading here. You're manifesting. But again, overthinking something, you're just... Yeah, this may be a codependent relationship here. Okay, codependent relationship. I do see somebody getting kicked out as well. Mm. Somebody's creating fake accounts. Be careful with any dates. Caution. Cautious. Caution. Okay. But let's see here. Somebody has a history here of violence. Somebody doesn't is not saying who they really are. I'm going to get down to the bottom of it. Yes, honeymoon. Some of you guys may be planning a honeymoon, vacation, um, trying to repair a relationship here. That's for some of you guys. Or planning a wedding and, or, you know, where are we going to go to our honeymoon and shit like that. Or attending a wedding. Some of you guys are living in Tennessee as well. Yes, commitment. Commitment is on the rocks here. Some of you guys' commitment is on the rocks. You came out fumbled. Okay, or some of you guys are renewing your vows or trying to make a commitment work. But a commitment is definitely coming in towards you guys. You guys maybe have been dealing with somebody that was married as well. Okay, pregnancy. Yes, it came in reverse. But somebody's trying to get pregnant here. and Somebody wants children and somebody doesn't want children. But some of you guys may have lost a child or having problems conceiving a child. Trying to get some type of, you know, um, infertility pill, um, IVF, um, or surrogate. Something about children and not being able to carry. Yes, patience. Okay, some of you guys are running out of patience here with it coming out flipped like that. Some of you guys are just deciding to get an animal or some of you guys have animals, love animals, have animals gravitate to you. Yes, follow your intuitions, okay? Yeah, check your health. But something about your intuitions that you need to follow here with people, no. The answer is no. So it's not the right time. 
So if you're trying to get pregnant or something like that, it's not the right time. Something about your health um, that needs further evaluation here. Yeah, vacation. Something may be delayed with traveling, like I said. Yeah, shock. There's shocking events unfolding, sudden change, news. You're going through a transformation, but something coming in swift. Yeah, it's not enough. There you go. This may be a domestic violence situation here. Um, phys physical abuse, um, verbal abuse. Be careful with kidnapping, kidnappings as well. But you feel trapped. Okay, there's a lot of self-sabotage here, a lack of confidence, insecurities here, ego and fear, frustrations. Yes, passion. This may be uh, full of chemistry or this may have been started out lustful, but there is a lustful energy coming in. You may have been dealing with somebody that, again, was married or non-committal here, was in and out of your life just for sex. It wasn't enough. Pay attention to the red flags. Yes, you're cutting some fucking bullshit out here. Some of you guys are celibate as well. Okay, but there's a separation coming. Okay, that's for some of you guys. You're stopping the pattern. Cutting those karmic, yeah, you're going through a renewal process, Phoenix. Yeah, if this is a karmic relationship that needs to be cut out, that's coming to an end. Okay, yes. Some of you guys are going on vacation by yourself, okay, burying someone. But again, uh, it's a change of perspective, rising from the ashes, but uh, a karmic relationship that is that you need to learn from here that is going to hell, is going down the drain here. It's like, how do we salvage this? Okay. Yeah, it's a book. You're entering into a new chapter, okay? Some of you guys are going back to church, but you have a strong belief system, faith. Yeah, there's something that was questionable about somebody's action. They were being dishonest. It was possibly a love triangle here, two or more people involved. This could be at work as well. Yeah, it's confetti, but there's some type of celebration coming in again. Wedding, a proposal, uh, a baby shower, yes, a uh, promotion, okay, retirement, Something like that. A birthday party you're invited to. Yes, you're embarking on a new journey. All you have is success on your mind. The roads are clear. Okay? But well, you're moving forward. You're going in a new direction. Again, moving as well. A new chapter. Some of you guys are going back to school. Yes, you're throwing out the trash. You're decluttering, you're decluttering and throwing out the fucking trash. Here. Yes, laptop. And start your own online business. But there's a lot of research taking place here. Somebody wants to communicate with you. But I do see online dating. Online dating as well. Some of you guys may work from home. Primarily on the computer, ITs, or graphic design. Some type of artist. Okay. But um, a social media presence. But I do see uh, a message coming through. Okay. You may have sent somebody a message and they left you on read. Mm-hmm. <laughs> But I do see you embarking on new journeys and researching and meeting somebody new online. This person may live a distance as well with journey. This person may go to church or you may be, be meeting somebody in church. Some of you guys may be born again Christians, but stay prayed up. Okay, but you guys are prayer, prayer warriors as well. Okay, this person that's coming in is traditional, have morals, you know, stuff like that. Uh, integrity, dignity. Yes. Hmm. Okay, let's see what's going on. Hold on. Okay, Sarah, so I put the hidden snake, creeping, skeletons, and catfish together. Get what you can. Yeah, blockages. This is somebody that you possibly blocked. You're focused on your independence, your money. Okay. Let's see here. There may be somebody single coming in as well that's financially stable. But I see you looking good. You're all about your finances, trying to get your money up. Wheel of Fortune. Hmm. <clears throat> this is somebody still holding on to your energy. This person may live a distance. This person may be an earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or Aquarius, Leo, Scorpio. Okay, yes. 
some of you guys are suffering financially or somebody here is suffering financially okay somebody's holding on to the fact of why they met you as well but somebody may be stealing money or hoarding money the sun in reverse somebody's not happy here okay and again this could be a loss of a pregnancy um, my condolences but with the sun in reverse this may be a Leo okay but there's something hidden somebody doesn't want something to something something somebody's in denial here or denying something here okay somebody's possibly saving up for their independence a child okay somebody may have had friends with benefits as well okay This could be somebody younger with the page here. What is going on here? Somebody's trying to sneak away here. Okay, somebody's trying to save their money in secrecy and plan to move, but there's delays. There's delays here. Now, somebody may have a child that live a distance as well. Okay, that's for some of you guys. But there may be a child here, but somebody may have been, somebody may have been, had friends with benefits. A sneaky link. Okay. But I do see somebody sneaking away, planning something here. In, se in secrecy. Yes. This is somebody that's snooping all over your social media as well. And again, this person may live a distance. Okay? With the Seven of Pentacles, this is somebody that you know for a long time. This may be a Virgo. There's something off with this energy, I tell you. This may be somebody older. This may be a Sagittarius. You used to work with this person. Something is not working out here, like I said. Okay, there's something off here. Be careful with termination. Some of you guys are losing your job. But there may be um, somebody at work looking at you here. Mm hmm and trying to build a case on someone here somebody may have lost their job and then tell you that they lost their job as well be acting like they're going to work but they're not going to work <laughs> okay yes that that kind of shit too <laughs> somebody may be looking for a job because they're out of out, out of work but um <laughs> They're not, they may be like, okay, I'm going to work now, but they're not going to work because they don't have a fucking job. <laughs> yes, Knight of Cups. Oof. With the Knight of Cups and the Two of Pentacles, somebody is nervous to come in to tell you how they feel about you. Some of you guys may have fell in love with somebody else as well. Okay, this is all about following your heart, but you may be juggling. Somebody may be juggling between you and another person here, okay? And they're still watching you, all right? But there's somebody here that you know for a long time or was invested in for a very long time that somebody's trying to move away from. <laughs> I'm telling you, okay? Something is not working out, though, but somebody's unemployed and pretending that they're employed here. But somebody here doesn't know how you feel about them or if you love them before they make a move here because somebody's planning something here. They're not happy in the situation that they're in and they're trying to save money here. They feel like you were fated to meet each other. You, you met each other for a reason, okay? 
And part of the reason was to show this person something because they're going through the dark night of the soul. A reflection is a lot of reflection going on with this person and why things are not working out in their life or why things didn't work out with you and them. Okay. Yes. You guys are not really, you guys are not really, you're not, you're not speaking to this person. They're not speaking. Okay. But for whatever it is, they're not happy as well. This person may have kids and children may be a factor here like as well. They have an obligation here. Okay. It's like, you know, they're trying to get their finances in order. Like, what do I what do I need to pay off before I make this move? But does Sagittarius still feel the same way? Now, for others, you may be planning to leave, leave a commitment, okay? You're saving your money and you're moving away from a situation, whether it's a household, uh, a commitment, but yes, something that you're planning to move away from, okay? But there's a nervousness here. Yes, the empress. There may be a pregnancy, but this is you. I put you as the empress. Somebody sees your worth. Somebody sees your value. Somebody sees you as their empress. This is empress, emperor, empress. But somebody sees you as their, as their everything. Now, somebody may be pregnant here, and they don't know what to do with this pregnancy. Okay? Whether they should keep the baby or not. This baby may not be... With the sun in reverse, this per this <laughs> this baby name may not be the child that they're that uh, for their partner, or vice versa. <laughs> okay, yes, <laughs> this is this is this is this is uh, this is some shit, uh, Taurus Libra. This is a secret. Yes, Queen of Pent. There we have the Queen of Pentacles. There you go. There you go. <laughs> There's somebody else on the side. You may be learning about a pregnancy. Okay, Queen of Pentacles is Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Some of you guys are married out there. But again, I do see uh, somebody on top of somebody here. This may be a mother-in-law. This may be a boss. This may be um, another wife figure. This may be a co-worker. But whatever it is, there's somebody else involved in this situation. That's the, I mean, it fell right on top of you. Okay, and somebody has to decide between their wife or somebody else. Okay, but there's a there's a there's there's gonna be a pregnancy coming, okay, and somebody possibly denying that they're pregnant or denying a pregnancy, like oh that's not my child or whatever the case may be, or I don't have any kids, but that is not the fucking case here. That's for some of you guys. This is up. If this is having happened, this is upcoming. Yes, nine of swords. Somebody's up in their head, anxiety. They don't know what to do about this fucking shit. But somebody wants. Somebody, somebody puts you in high regards on a pedestal, okay? They see you as a good business person, entrepreneur, stable, um, a maternal figure, yes. Yeah, nine of, nine of wands. Yeah, somebody was having sex here. Somebody was stepping out of their relationship and having sex. And now it's a toss-up between, you know, how am I, I and if they're, if you guys are married, and if this is your spouse, they're trying to figure out how they're going to tell you about this bullshit here. Okay, because somebody's money-hungry here as well. Okay. <laughs> uh-huh. But I see that, you know, you feel like, you know, it's like you're, you're not, it's like always some bullshit going on in your life. <laughs> Okay, this may be your kids as well, or somebody that you know that this is happening to. This not this is, this is not your story, but I'm gonna tell you this much: some of you guys know this person that's on top of you already. That's the enemy. Somebody very jealous of you and your status. Okay. Mhm. Mm yes, and you may be finding out that your friend or a coworker or somebody that you know is sleeping with your significant other. Secrecy, yes. Yes, there's another woman. There you go. This is your energy. This person may be younger than you, but they may be a child involved in this situation as well. But somebody has a crush on you. Yes, and they're going to send you a message. Somebody wants to take a chance with you here. Okay, this is possibly somebody that you rejected or rejected you. But whatever it is, they want your cup of love. Somebody wants your cup of love here. Yes, they want your cup of love. <laughs> okay, so this is meant, meant to be is coming in. Okay, hold on, guys. Yes, for some of you guys, you didn't have sex with this person. There's a lot of admiration for someone here. 
as well and again i do see online online messaging or email but somebody wants to take a chance with you here want new beginnings or vice versa this may be an aries uh, uh aries aquarius aries leo sagittarius pisces cancer scorpio okay but there's somebody here that's feeling rejected here but they still have their eye on you this is somebody that's very attractive somebody has a lot of somebody wants to give you the business there's a lot of somebody's holding their self back okay I'm not going to lie. They never met anyone like you. This is meant to be. You may meet this person around summer. This person may be a cancer, but it's, it's fireworks. This, this, this person finds you to be very fiery. It's something about you. It's like, wow, who is, who is Sagittarius? Who is this person? Okay. <laughs> okay. They're holding back their desire for you as well. They have a crush on you. They're falling in love with you. And this is somebody here that you haven't had sex with. Now take the rose, hot resonate. But somebody's feeling like somebody's going to reject them because somebody possibly get a lot of attention here. But whoever this person is, this person possibly have a, a online social media presence here. Okay. Um, a business person of some sort. They're good looking, courageous, strong, fiery. They like this. They like this. This person been watching you or studying you for a very long time as well, um, Sagittarius. But with the Eight of Pentacles in reverse, for some reason, somehow, somebody feels like something is not going to work out between you and them. Possibly because of distance. But somebody may be in a commitment as well that's failing. But follow your intuitions. You could possibly feel this already now. For others, you may know this person. And they rejected you and they want to take a chance with you now. Um, they not only have feelings for you, but they have a crush on you, which is kind of cute. They see your glow up, okay? They, you know, they they see your value, okay? But this is somebody that you used to possibly work with as well. But some of you guys don't work with this person, never met this person, yes, okay? But for some reason, this person feel like it's meant to be. Yes, you're everything that this person desires. This person is single, good-looking, have their shit together. Like I said, this person may be an Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. This person is coming in. Very honest, very truthful here. I see that this could lead to marriage. This is divinely guided. Yeah, but lovers, this person is in love. This person feels a soul connection. And again, some of you guys may have not slept with this person, but for others, you may have slept with this person and there may be a marriage involved here. But <clears throat> I see somebody cutting out a marriage here. Or you set those healthy boundaries. But somebody wants to come speak their truth because somebody fell in love here. But somebody possibly have responsibilities in a marriage and kids. Okay, this may be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Yeah, they're stuck in a situation which is causing delays. Somebody may be going to court right now. There's battles in court over children. Okay, yes. Uh-huh. Okay, so I... Yeah, follow your intuitions when dealing with anyone, but catfish. So somebody's definitely creating fake accounts to watch you here, okay? But again, you have snakes around you. Somebody may have a past criminal history as well with violence and locked up and shit like that, okay? Somebody may be a womanizer as well, okay? Yes. Like to uh, like to reach out to people and shit like that, but somebody here, um, it's, it's, it's something, something here about this person. They don't, somebody doesn't like rejection here, okay? They have a dark side to them that they hide from people, okay? But this person likes to most likely fuck around here. But this person could have a hot temper as well and do things impulsive, okay? Somebody may be, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get more, more details on this. More. I just want the snake and hidden and cat, yeah. I just, I just want the snake. I just skeletons, okay. Snake, catfish, creeping. Who is this specifically? But there's somebody right on top of you here. Right on top of you. And it was a, a Taurus Libra or a Taurus Capricorn Virgo. Yes, King of Wands. This is somebody, this is your energy. This is somebody that's fucking around here. This is a player, okay? Somebody is playing the field here. This may be a Leo. This person is very prideful, very arrogant. Looks good as well. Yes, the Emperor. Somebody may be going to court. Yes, that's the truth. Okay, but somebody's a liar here. Somebody's not telling the whole truth here. This may be an Aries or Taurus. Yes, temperance came out fumble. 
Okay, somebody's life is not somebody life is not as balanced as they say it is. This person may have a bipolar disorder or have some type of mental health issues as well. Yes, Queen of Swords in reverse. Ooh. This person could get very nasty. This person could be a gossiper. This could this person could be an Aquarius Gemini Libra that's around you that's gossiping behind your back. Yes, this could, it could be a Sagittarius or a Scorpio as well, but somebody's on the judgment here. Somebody may be telling lies on you behind your back to get you fired, telling lies to the boss here. Yes, some of you guys may work or get somebody locked up here. Okay, ooh. Mm. Yes, ooh, I do see a fight breaking out here, but again, somebody has a criminal history here. Okay, possibly of domestic violence or, yeah, have a hot temper. Do things impulsively. Keep careful with this catfish. They're not, they're lying. They're not, yes, this person may live a distance as well, but their life is not together. This person may have served time before, but their money is not... Their money is not balanced out. This is this is this is somebody who's struggling financially. There's a lot of regret and remorse about uh, around this person. As well, yes. Somebody's remorseful about you as well. Okay, some of you guys may be dealing with somebody that's locked up. Yes, three of cups. This may have been a third party situation, or somebody likes to carry on a lot of relationships here. Likes to sleep around here, yes, in a marriage. Okay, but I do see a reunion coming, but these are people that you hang out with. Okay, this is somebody that you know possibly sleeping with your significant other. Yes, and I see a fight and an argument, jealousy, blockages. Yes, this may be a queen of pentacles, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, but this is somebody that's married. Or in a relationship already. Okay. Hold on. Okay, this is getting interesting. So let's pull tarot. Yeah, King of Wands. There we go. There we, this is your energy, though, taking charge. But somebody wants to take action towards you. Somebody that's still holding on to your energy here. Okay, but this is somebody that's holding back as well. Somebody may be suffering financially, or you are. But this is taking the lead in your life. Okay, somebody courageous, bold, possibly arrogant, prideful as well. Stubborn. Yes, Page of Swords. A lot of spying going on here. Planning as well. Okay. Hmm. Somebody's being logical here, but somebody's curious about you as well. Yes, Page of Cups. Somebody has a crush here. Somebody has a crush on someone here. Okay, just watching, learning you. Okay. This may be somebody younger or of young spirit. Page, Page, young energy. All right. Follow your intuitions. Um... <laughs> Yes. Um, this somebody wants to apologize to you as well, but I do see somebody kissing your ass. But somebody has a gift. Somebody coming in very warm, very gift giving. You know, teacher student dynamic going on here. Yes, two of wands in reverse. There's a fear change going on here with you. There's an indecisiveness. You you may be restricted by options here. This is why the, the moving came out fumble. Okay, but there's negotiations taking place here, but there's failed negotiations, something not working out here. Yes, the emperor. Some of you guys may be going to court, but this is uh, Aries, Taurus. Some of you guys are already entrepreneurs, bosses out there. Some, some of you guys may be delegating a task or negotiating a deal and it's not working out. And some of you guys may be going to court and waiting no decision. Yes, yeah, two of pentacles. There's a nervousness surrounding this. Okay, you guys are trying to find balance, trying to do things in moderation, but you guys, your finances is off. Some of you guys' finances are off. Okay, some of you guys may be seeking some type of assistance here in terms of uh, like housing support or, you know, um, any, any, any type of assistant, government, government assistant. Okay, I do see a partnership, but the partnership is up and down. Somebody, some of you guys may have been juggling between two people or somebody was juggling you some of you guys are juggling between jobs as well but you have a lot on your plate here but there's a decision that needs to be made here and it's like 
what do I do? What do I do? But there's a fear surrounding this as well. Okay. Yes. It's about surrounding money. Okay. There's a job coming in, a higher position. But this is about money. This is about your stability. This is about a marriage. This is about long-term commitment here. Okay. But you're trying to get your finances in order. You don't know if the, you know, you're going to get the money that you're seeking or a deal is going to come through for you. But I see money coming in, a big deal coming in for you guys. What's this about? Somebody may want to get married here, but you may not. Yeah, but somebody is a big deal coming in. Temperance, you're going to take your time here, but somebody wants to balance things out between you and them, bring peace to a situation here. Patience is key, okay? But there's a back payment coming for you guys. A soulmate coming in as well, possibly a Sagittarius. Yeah, four swords. Right now is rest and recuperation. Some of you guys are still resting from a surgery or healing from something, but there's a lot of meditation and deep contemplation taking place here. Fear, anxiety, trying to fight fear, staying prayed up, okay? But um, some of you guys may be in the hospital as well, getting some type of payment for some type of injury, uh, like workers comp or um, medical malpractice, something like that, okay? But trying to get your finances in order. Juggling a lot. Yeah, Queen of Swords. You're setting those healthy boundaries. This may be an Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, but you're being very direct with people. Straight, straight and narrow, straightforward. Okay, you suffered a lot of losses in life and hardships and no more. Okay, some of you guys may be consulting with a lawyer as well. Okay, or thinking about it. Okay, but um, I see that somebody wants to bring clarity to a situation here. You may be speaking your truth to someone here that doesn't want to hear it. That's, oh, you know, that we can work this out. But somebody here is a fear. Is a fair change because finances is involved here. It's not so much a love. I don't see love. This is somebody that likes to kiss your ass as well. Okay. This could be your own kids that's going through this bullshit. All right. But um, you're really head over heart. Yes. Seven of Wands. There may be somebody defending you as well. You're taking a stand. You're very defensive. You're very defensive. You have you have a no nonsense kind of attitude. You're not fucking around with people, but this is coming. This is having to do with your stability, and somebody's fucking up your stability here. And again, this could be one of your kids. Now, somebody may be stealing or hoarding money, like I said in the beginning. All right, but you're standing up for what you believe in. Okay, you're determined. You're being assertive here. Yes. Three of cups. Oh, you see how it came out? It came out like that. There's a friend group that's deceiving you here. I see you blocking out a friend group, but there's somebody that's, there's somebody playing both sides of the field and being two-faced here. Okay? Yes. Talking shit behind your back as well. Uh-huh. Smiling your face. Fake smiles. F smiling your face, but, you know, talking shit about you. This may be a third-party situation as well, but somebody's not to be trusted here. This could be family as well. Strength. Yes, you're building your, your strength to do what you need to do, your courage at this time, your inner strength, okay, but you're focused, you're focused, you're building your confidence as well, mm -hmm. but you're overcoming self-doubt and obstacles. Take your control back, Leo. Yes, the lovers, there you go, there may be lovers here, and this is somebody that you know or used to hang out with, or you still hang out with. But I do see blockages and somebody denying something because I do see somebody speaking about something here. Somebody's confronting somebody here, right? And somebody's denying it. Like, oh, that's not true in a friend group. Somebody's being defensive here, okay? But the lovers, the lovers came out here, okay? There's a choice in love here. And again, and again all of y'all may know each other, hang out with, with each other, and this could be family. I didn't see family yet, but Gemini, yes. There's a partnership coming in as well. But there's a soul contract. Somebody fell in love here. There's deep, there's deep feelings for someone here. Yes, Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cash, Scorpio. There may be a mother figure involved or children involved, like I said. Okay. But there's definitely uh, somebody involved here that has kids. Pisces, Cash, Scorpio. And again, this may be about kids and a pregnancy. Yes, the hangman. There's the ladies, okay? I don't see you really speaking to this person. This person may be a Pisces, okay, in particular. But you're feeling trapped, 
okay needing to release the situation here too much shit going on here okay you're waiting waiting but it's getting a new perspective but a lesson needed to be learned here what is this about overthinking something here yes yeah, seven of pentacles your money making investments making wise investments working hard you don't see any growth but there's no growth here in a situation and again some of you guys may be seeking a surrogate you know for a child to get pregnant you know to have a child here okay yes and some of you guys how can i say some of you guys has I don't know how to explain it. I'm going to explain it the best way I can. Some of you guys, child's father can't produce children or they have a low sp sperm count. Okay, so it's like a donor of some sort. Okay, something like that. <laughs> I'm just saying. Okay, some of you guys have your eggs frozen as well. Yeah. But um, with the Seven of Pentacles, right now, you're manifesting ideas. And you're trying to work on projects, but you don't see any growth, any growth in a relationship. No. It's, uh, and if you guys are trying to get pregnant, it's taking some time. Yes, but this is somebody that you know for a long time as well. Yes, Eight of Pentacles. You possibly work with this person. Okay, you possibly you're looking for a new job as well. You guys are starting up your own business. Okay, mastering your skills, but committed to working, working, working on yourself, rebuilding yourself. Yes, four of pentacles. Some of you guys are struggling, financially struggling. You're working, 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 but you don't see the fruits of your labor. But there's a payment coming in. Okay, some of you guys are holding on to your job for dear life as well. That's all you have, you know, for now. But, um, hmm. I see saving money, saving money and balance, a lot going on here. Yes, two of swords, blocking people out. There's blockages. There's blockages. There's a stalemate, though. You, there, you have some huge decisions to make here, but you're on the fence about things. But it's a painful choice, okay? It is. But again, somebody may claim to, to be working, and they're not working. They're still looking for a job. With the Seven of Pentacles, eight, somebody's looking for a job. They're not working. And it's like, where's the money? Okay, I don't see any money. I don't see any growth. You're working, 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 but where's the money? But honestly, this person possibly doesn't have a job and still looking for a job. And they don't want you to know that. They're denying something here about the job and why their money is so low, something like that. Somebody's not being honest here about their money, about a work aspect. Um, yes, something that they're not being honest about. Because it's not making sense to me and I'm trying to make it, make it, make it make sense. Because somebody planning to move away as well. There's a mother figure possibly trying to help somebody here. But seven of pentacles, eight of pentacles, four of pentacles. You're working, but you're still broke. Where's the money? Okay? Where's the money? Two of, two of pentacles. Somebody's struggling here. There's a, a there's an imbalance. And it's like somebody questioning about money as well. Somebody being defensive and somebody's not telling the whole truth here. Somebody doesn't want somebody to know that they lost their job or they're not working here and they're trying to find another job here. That's for some of you guys. Yeah, Six of Pentacles. Where's the money? Where's my half? Because somebody is an imbalance here. Somebody's doing more than, than somebody else. Okay? Yes. Um, Page of Wands, King of Wands. This is a family. Yes, this is a family. You may be dealing with a player in your own family that likes a lot of attention, competition, fights, arguments, possibly going to court as well. Yes. I feel it, okay? But somebody may have taken out paperwork on this person as well. Somebody needs to pay something here. Yes, possibly for a child, 
a lot of payment, a lot of money. Somebody's seeking a lot of money here. They don't know where they're going to get the money from because if they are working, they're garnishing their wages. Somebody doesn't want somebody to know that they're garnishing their wages. That could be that too. But there's definitely the law here. Somebody fighting in court, somebody being def defending, fake friends. But this is a friend, friend situation here, a mother involved in the situation here, a family. But somebody was a player, a player. Now, this could be your situation or this could be somebody that you're seeing or somebody that you know that's going through this fucking bullshit, okay? But I do see a victory in court for you guys, a win in court, but there's a lot of fire here. There may have been a physical altercation as well, but somebody needs to pay some type of money here, a lot of money coming your way. Yes. Yes, it is. Okay, and this is towards somebody's freedom to move forward, but you're moving away from the chaos. You're trying to get away from the chaos here. Okay, this may be an Aquarius, a Libra, Aries, or Sagittarius. Mm -hmm. But somebody doesn't want to go to court as well. Somebody doesn't want to go to court with you because they don't want to pay you money as well. If you find out about some type of infidelity and them sleeping around, because I do see somebody looking through text messages as well, trying to get catch somebody out there. Mm. Some of you guys are celebrity status, or this is what you're envisioning yourself, because I do see you on top of your game here. Okay? Get some type of promotion, but being famous, successful. Mm. What else is going on here? I do see you getting some type of recognition and award as well. Yes, Five of Swords. There you go. Jealousy. A lot of jealousy here. Look, somebody being deceptive. Fight, arguments, illegal activities. Somebody's lying here. There you go. Somebody's lying about their sexual rendezvous. I can't make this up. Yes. King, Queen of Swords is the perfect match. This may be business. Yes. King, yep. There you go. Somebody possibly served papers that they're the father of a child or somebody's claiming that they're the father of the child. Somebody doesn't want somebody to find out here. They're very remorseful. A lot of regrets here. Heartbroken. Yes. That thing's a child. There's a child here. Things coming to light about a situation. Okay. Somebody's worried. They don't know what to do here. They're overthinking something here. And this could be your child. This could, be, this could be your child that got into an altercation as well, okay? There's something impulsive. Again, stealing could have taken place here because some of you guys are, are trying to figure out where your money is going, okay? But I do see some type of violence taking place here, some type of fight. Somebody uh, under investigation here. This could be a dad um, as well. This could be in a family. Somebody getting injured here because I did see somebody getting locked up. Let me end this. Yes, this is a burden on someone, okay? Because somebody's married here. Yes, Three of Pentacles trying to work out a deal here. That's the truth. That's the truth, okay? But somebody's getting out of a marriage here. Yeah, somebody possibly got locked up. Somebody has a dark history here. Uh-huh. A violence. Like I said, catfish. Be careful, okay? Be very fucking careful. This person is for the streets. Capricorn, Yes. And again, this may be a, a pregnancy, but a karmic pregnancy, karmic pregnancy. Somebody else got involved, uh, somebody else is pregnant here, okay? Or they got somebody pregnant here by being um, toxic and sleeping around with people, okay? Now they're stuck in a situation and trying to negotiate a deal here, but silently, they don't want this shit to come out, negotiate a deal. So, you know, you know, but again... Somebody, if something is not working out with negotiations, and I see somebody taking somebody to court here. It's over children, yes. This is somebody that you know for, for, for a very long time as well. This could be friends, okay? But um, shock, there you go, shock, okay? It's going to take you by surprise. And I do see a fight taking place here, an argument, a fight, um, a lot of shit going on here, a lot. It is, it's like ultimate, it's like a betrayal, okay? Yes, it's a, it is a betrayal. It is. But there's a soulmate coming in, but this is not this is not this. This is a lot of shit that you need to clear up. Okay, yeah, communication is coming in. This is possibly a Scorpio. Uh some of you guys are married towards Capricorn Virgo, working on your heart chakra here. Yes. Follow your intuitions. you 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 have a lot of spiritual gifts that you need to um tap into. Yes, this may be a Pisces. 
okay but i do see fertility follow your intuitions you guys are remaining hidden okay yes divine masculine coming in like i said this person may work out this person looks good but yes there's a secret see there's secrets here <laughs> there's secrets here okay yeah you guys are moving secret secretly moving on okay this may be a gemini or a leo there's communication coming in So listen, if this is not you going through this, this is your divine going through this. Somebody that, if you, some, some of you guys that haven't met your divine, and some of you guys have, but they're going through some shit on their end. If this is not you, yeah, the floodgates are opening, your money is fucking coming in, and I do see a big proposal. Somebody wants to marry you here. Yes, this was over the lovers, and somebody had a sex addiction. There you go. There you go. And somebody's married here. Okay, but somebody got pregnant here. Yes, they're going to get their fucking karma. Okay, there's some type of secrecy and mystery surrounding this. Okay, yes. There's uh, somebody that was a player here. But I see that you're all about action. Yes, there's a baby mom here, an energy vampire. Okay, I see you breaking those generational curses, the first millionaire in your family. But whoever is coming in, it's it's a boss up. They, yeah, something like this. This is a crazy ass creature. This is a crazy ass reading, but somebody wants you a couple of. I, I tell you that much. Yeah, root chakra. Your work, you're staying grounded. It's all about your, secu your security, your stability, your confidence. Listen to your instincts and your intuitions. Pay attention to the red flags. This may be a Leo coming in or a Taurus Capricorn Virgo. But again, somebody's married here. Or you're married, or both of you are married. But this is a businesswoman, a business person. This may be a Cancer. This is a family person. Okay, Queen of Fire. Your perfect match is coming in. I told you. <laughs> But somebody got somebody somebody has to get rid of somebody here, okay? A karmic partner. Yes, you turn. Okay, pay attention to the red flags. You guys are still going through the healing. Some of you guys are working on your shadow side, but you're dealing with somebody that's low vibrational. Yeah, you're, you're releasing this. Somebody's releasing something here that's causing tower moments, possibly a pregnancy. Something was found out about a pregnancy, possibly a Taurus here. But there's a new love coming in. Okay, new feelings. This person may be some type of healer, light worker, nurse, doctor. Your money is coming in as well. Something is about to close out here. Some of you guys may have your own social media base. And uh, be tower readers. This may be an Aries, or this person has a lot of fire in their chart. This person's very fiery. <laughs> yes, this may be an Aquarius. Okay. Yes. Uh huh. Whoa. Okay. <clears throat> this is this is some shit. This is some shit. All right. This is what this is. I got to close out your reading, Sagittarius. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> oh, please like, share, and subscribe. Okay, I'm going to be giving away um, to 10 lucky winners my uh, Love Jones deck when I hit 55,000. I'm sorry, I'm only mailing within the United States. Okay. Yes, can we talk? Somebody wants to talk here. Somebody that's in love with you. This person may be married. Somebody's getting tower readings and insight. Somebody, some of you guys are tower readers or learning tower reading. Yeah, follow your intuitions. This may have been friends with benefits as well. <laughs> uh huh. Yes, there may cho there may be children involved that's affecting this uh, relationship. Okay, this person may be younger. This is an unbreakable bond between you and this person. Yes, a pregnancy. There you go. A pregnancy, children, till death do us part. This is a marriage here. Somebody stabbed you in the back. Yeah, this is painful. But, yes, they're keeping tabs on you as well. You're moving on. But it's having a hard time moving on. Okay. Yes, heartbroken and crushed. Yes, yeah, somebody's manifesting you as well. Uh-huh. But the manifestation is delayed. Yes, yeah, somebody's trying to... Connect with you on the 5D, telepathy. Yes, this is Twin Flame for some of you guys. And crying. Yeah, depressed and crying. Yeah, somebody's depressed and crying. This is a karmic partner and family involved. Yes. Okay. One more. And there's a celebration coming. Okay. Yes, I masturbate to you. Whoa. Yeah. All right. So there's a lot of masturbation taking place here as well. Let's see who this is. Somebody fell in love. Even if you didn't have sex with this person, this person is in love. Just with you, how you are as a person, okay? Yes, this person is a business person you may meet through work, okay? This person is very successful. This person may be younger. 
light skin, um, a music artist, some type of entertainment, into fashion, uh, red hair, uh, very sexy, good looking, yeah, family, this person may have a family already, or this person is a family oriented person, this person may want to start a family with you, have kids with you as well, yes, there's a true love coming in. Okay, but there may be obstacles. A dating queen. This person is. This is possibly somebody that has a lot of get a lot of attention, and you know that's what I was telling you. But there's gifts coming. That's what I said. But there's true love coming in. Okay, yes, you're releasing yourself from an environment that was like somebody was gaslighting. You're taking your power back. But there's an honest and pure connection coming in. Possibly a light skinned person, um, with blondish hair and light eyes. Okay, a soulmate. Yes, a soulmate. Okay, a younger person. I see younger. Okay, that's for some of you guys. Okay, let, let me wrap this up. Let me wrap this up. Here we go. Illumination. This coming to light. It says, something hidden is coming to light now. Find you find out about new jobs, opportunities, and options. Someone lends you a helping hand. So somebody's gonna lend you a helping hand, but something's coming to light, like I said. Okay, wait for it, Sag. Something is about to be illuminated. Aha, uh -huh. got you now, motherfucker. But yeah, there's some there's some fucking shady shit going on here. Hmm. Okay. Lemon, yes. Dismissive, sneaky, vicious, and unforgiving. Yes, somebody's being sneaky here, but when you, when life serves you lemonade, I mean, lemons make uh, lemonade. Uh, avocado, it says admired. Yes, yeah, somebody's admiring you. Noble, flirtatious, go getter, and a winning spirit. That's this person coming in. But you have a winning spirit and you're a go getter. But there's a lot of flirting coming in. Okay, yes, one more. And blueberry, it says royalty, tranquility, sacrifice, caution, use discernment, may suffer from heart disease. Okay, so check your heart, but caution, but royalty, royalty, <laughs> all right, uh, let me get one of these. Oh, what the fuck am I doing? Denial. You see? Somebody's in denial. There's some type of deception. You see? What I said. There is a situation that you are refusing to see clearly. Living in denial can create false scenarios to see things that are not accurate. Have the courage and discernment to dig deep into the truth of the situation. Everything I was just saying. Yes. And where's my other deck? Oh. And I'm closing out your reading. Somebody doesn't want to face the truth here. Somebody's in denial. Okay? Everything I was saying. And hand. There's a helping hand coming. Okay? A generous offer as well. But manifesting money, reach goals, financial assistance. Yes, I said some type of financial assistance that you're seeking. Career, hands-on work, help getting a job. Some of you guys may work for like um, elderly people, um, home health aides and stuff like that, okay? Chefs, cooks, something like that. But um, yeah, somebody's in the now here, not willing to face the truth. And hand came in, came fumbled, which means that your manifestation is not taking place here because something needs to be cut out here, okay? There's an imbalance here, all right? But anyway, Sagittarius, I have to go. I love you guys. I'm possible. You're possible. Your girl Tosh, I'm out.